Annie returns to the Great White Way with a new star and a new four-legged co-star. It's the highly anticipated revival of this iconic show, and 1010 Winds got to meet the cast members who were raring to go. I'm really excited. The rehearsals have been really fun, and I can't wait till the show starts. I think people will come and really get a great traditional production. I think they'll really enjoy it. Everyone's sort of totally committed, and I just uh, absolutely adore that. But Annie wouldn't be Annie without Sandy the dog. The four-legged co-star of this production is Sonny, a rescue dog adopted by Broadway's longtime animal trainer, William Berloni, who told us the 2012 revival represents a full-circle moment in his life. Yep, started my career when I was 19 years old, working in a theater that did the show originally, and I went to a shelter and found a dog, and that this show has changed my life, and also changed, I think, the, the, the plight of animals who need homes. Right, because all of the dogs in all the shows, including Legally Blonde, Right, and The Wiz, they've all been rescues. Yep, all the dogs I ever train, even cats, we rescue from animal shelters as well. Tell us Sunny's story. She, I rescued her from a shelter down in Houston. She's got an understudy whose name is Casey, who also came from a shelter down in Nashville. I bet a lot of people don't know that, that there has to be an understudy dog, right? Oh, yes. I mean, if, if she gets sick, I'm not putting on a dog suit and going on. So, everybody has an understudy study. Tell me just a little bit about the process in, in training Sunny for this show. Just briefly, what is that process like? Well, I've had six months from the day she got out of the shelter to get her ready for Broadway. So not only did she have to learn the cues and get used to all the everything else, but we have to train the actress, Lilla Crawford, how to be an animal handler and be her best friend. I understand that Pedigree is doing something really interesting with this show, right, in terms of a charity fundraiser. Uh, amazing partnership with Pedigree. Um, you know, for the first time, uh, a big sponsor like that is working on a Broadway show, and I'm glad it's about rescuing animals. We're doing a campaign called Buy a Ticket, Save a Dog. Pedigree is donating up to a million dollars to animal charities. You know, and they have other initiatives, too, we're involved with. Their Pedigree Feeding Initiative. We're doing shelters where we're supplying all the food. So it's really a wonderful partnership and really bringing Broadway. Broadway and Animal Rescue together. So it was definitely love at first sight for me. But what does the cast think of Sunny? It's so fun. I mean, I, I have a dog, but I've never worked with one in a show before. So it's really an experience, and I'm really excited. She's so sweet and she's so cute. I don't engage with the dog very often because Miss Hannigan and the dog do not get along. So I try to keep it real method in the rehearsal hall. That must be tough. <laughs> really cute dog. And so is the dog going to do any moves? <laughs> the dog actually is the probably the cleanest performer out there. That dog knows where he, she's going every time. It's really great. <laughs> Sandy's really fabulous and the dog, the, the team that's behind the dog is really, really great. The dog will get the Tony, let's face it. <laughs> Learn more about Sonny, Casey, and all of William Berloni's star animals in a newly published updated version of his book, Broadway Tales. For more information about Annie, visit AnnieTheMusical.com. Susan Richard, 1010 Wins News.